Yep, that's me. I know what you're thinking. How do I end up like this? Well, it all started with a massage therapist named Dana. Mm. Ooh. Oh, you really are amazing. Thanks. I've been doing this for five years. No, no, I mean as a person. You are so sweet. And so it began. I felt deeply in love. We went to her favorite movies and my favorite restaurants. She was the one. But I wasn't. You see, she was infatuated with Iron Man. And when she found her Tony Stark, I was about as exciting as yesterday's meatloaf. I'm not sure what she saw in that guy. I saw an arrogant turkey, but she saw a superhero in shining armor. <laughs> and I said, no way, never again. <laughs> never, never again. again. <laughs> never, never again. again. It was over. Can I get another for you? To make matters worse, not even the stiffest of drinks could get her out of my head. I had to do something drastic. It was him or me. Here, take that, Stony Stark! It wasn't that I missed, but the knife had no effect on him. It was as if he was Iron Man. That was my wake-up call. I had to get out. Not just jail, but out of Legoland. I had to get away. I had to end my misery. But no matter what I tried, I couldn't end myself. It turns out minifigs are made of rock-hard plastic. As I survived attempt after attempt, I grew more confident. Maybe I could be Dana's knight in shining armor. This attempt should have destroyed me. But I was saved by the very flowers that doomed me. And some overly helpful friends. Oh my! You'll be okay. Just a couple of scratches. And when it couldn't get any worse, we were boxed up. Our owner was done with Lego, and I was forced to be near those who destroyed my life. I went to where my friends couldn't save me. Goodbye, Legoland. Goodbye, owner. I have no idea how long I laid there, trapped in my thoughts. Days, weeks, years. If I had known Legos floated, I never would have jumped in. And then it happened. I don't know where I'm going, and I don't care. I've been given a second chance, a second life. Besides, I see one, maybe two reasons to forget Dana forever. 